everyone, this is your horoscope for the week of May 30th, brought to you by InsightfulAstrology.com. On Sunday, Saturn, your ruling planet of lessons and structure, will turn direct in the ninth house of your horoscope. Saturn has been moving through the ninth house for the past couple of years, and what this is doing is causing you to create new and lasting structure around your beliefs and your personal philosophy. In addition to this, Saturn through the ninth house is a wonderful time to take on a new course of study that requires deep concentration and focus. You are at your best doing this now, and from now until the end of July, you will begin to integrate all of these lessons and begin to see tremendous rewards for your concentration and focus. On Monday, Neptune, the planet of spirituality, faith, and illusion will turn retrograde in your second house of earned income. What's happening for you lately is you're not seeing the full picture when it comes to finances. Maybe you are being fooled, you're fooling yourself, you're, you're just being a little too optimistic and not really focusing on the uh, stability and the details that you need to. Well, Neptune now turning retrograde will give you an ability to realize where you might have not been seeing the whole picture. The cloud will lift for a little while and that's a good thing for you. On Friday, Mars, the planet of action and energy, will oppose Neptune. Mars is now in the eighth house of your horoscope, which rules other people's money, and it is all about credit card debt, uh, loans, mortgages, investments. Mars going through this part of your chart could aggravate some of these expenses, and it causes you to assertively go after any solutions. Well, now that Mars will oppose Neptune, there is a very strong likelihood that you will realize that you might have been doing too much when it comes to building up the credit cards, taking on this loan, or, or thinking that you're invincible in financial matters. Neptune will awaken you to the fact that even you have limits in the financial department. 